The Motorola Razr i comes with an Intel Atom chip inside and is expected to get a Jelly Bean update soon. And you'll be able to get all this for under £300. We take a closer look at what it can do. Build wise at 122.5mm long and 8.3mm thick, it's about the same size as the iPhone 5, albeit a little fatter and 14 grams heavier, weighing 126 grams. It's made of a mixture of Kevlar and glass, which gives it a premium but also tough finish. There's also a dedicated camera button on the side. The big selling point of this phone is the screen. It's edge to edge, so no space is wasted around the 4.3 inches. The resolution is 540 by 960 with a pixel density of 256. It's also Super AMOLED, so blacks look very black and colours pop out from the screen. The Razer Eye is one of the first Intel inside phones to come to the UK, with a single core chip clocking at 2 GHz. The 2100 mAh battery, coupled with the modestly sized screen, means power is definitely not a problem, despite the fast processor, giving us about 30 hours of usage before it died. The handset ships with Android Ice Cream Sandwich, with a Jelly Bean update expected very soon, and Motorola have added their own skin over the top. On the home screen you also get three useful bubble widgets that work as shortcuts for utility apps like the clock. There's multiple home screens to load up with what you want, and then swiping to the right brings up a handy page management system. The back-facing camera is 8 megapixels and comes with a flash, and the front-facing camera is VGA, so not quite as good as lots of others out there, but does the job. The Razer Eye comes with a rather paltry 8 gig of storage, but luckily there's a micro SD card slot, allowing you to boost that by 32 gigabytes. All in all then, the Razer Eye is a very decent phone. It's not top of the range like the Samsung Galaxy S3 or HTC One X for example, but it does everything you need it to do and well. Plus it costs nearly half the price of the iPhone 5.